Hi everyone, just waiting for Sahil to join and then he will be connected with us and we'll begin the session. Sahil is here, so we are joining him to the live and we would begin the minute we get connected. Hello, hello. Hi, Hi Sahil, you can hear me? Yes, 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 yes. How are you? Okay. Very well. We have people joining us now and yes. um, let few more people join before I start introducing you and take right. today's talk further. I believe you're you are in Delhi these days. Delhi? Or should I go live from mine and would you join there? Sorry, you are coming alive. Your voice is breaking. Okay, let me connect again. Let me connect again. Thank you. Sahil is re-logging again, so just waiting for him to re-log in. Two, three minutes. Hi, we are online now. Yes, hi. I was thinking that I would go live from mine and then you would add me there then. How are you? Oh, okay. Good. All well. All well. You tell me. You are in I'm Delhi good. these days, right? Yeah. Where are you right now? In London. Oh, okay. 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 Of course. Of course. Yeah. yeah. So, um, Sahil, before we go any further, though most of the people who would be watching this or are online would know about you. But still, right. let me set up the context and then we can uh, start from there. Dogri. 
ਡੋਗਰੀ ਚ ਵੀ ਗੱਲ ਕਰ ਸਕਦੇ ਆਸ ਥੋੜੀ ਜਈ ਬਟ ਮੋਸਟ ਆਫ ਦੀ ਕਨਵਰਸੇਸ਼ਨ ਵਿਲ ਬੀ ਇਨ ਇੰਗਲਿਸ਼ অর ਹਿੰਦੀ ਟੂ ਰੀਚ ਆਊਟ ਟੂ ਦਾ ਲਾਰਜਰ ਆਡੀਅנס ਰਾਈਟ ਬਟ ਵੀ ਕੈਨ ਟੱਚ ਅਪਨ ਡੋਗਰੀ ਇਫ ਇਟਸ ਐਸ ਯੂ ਆਈ ਆਈ ਸਪੀਕ ਟੂ ਇੰਗਲਿਸ਼ ਬਿਕਾਜ਼ ਮਾਈ ਡੋਗਰੀ ਇਜ਼ ਸਲਾਈਟਲੀ ਟਾਈਟ ਮਤਲਬ ਥੋੜਾ ਬਹੁਤ ਬੋਲ ਸਕਦਾ ਪਰ ਕੂਲ ਸੋ ਫੋਰ एवरीबॉडी ਹੂਸ ਸੌਰੀ ਕਮ ਅਗੇਨ now you hanging again but okay okay let's go okay so today we have with us sahil salatia from jammu an international model who who has walked the ramp on various fashion shows around the globe sahil made his acting debut as a main lead in ashutosh gavarikar's everest tv series he was also awarded the best fresh face award for that uh, year sahil hosted ifa for three consecutive years in bangkok madrid and uh, new york he is now featuring in hasmuk on netflix right and sahil yeah. has recently made his debut in bollywood in the blockbuster period film panipat which is also directed by ashutosh gavarkar in the role of shamsher bahadur for those who don't right. know he was the son of baji rao and mastan bhai right so right so right, that right, is right. a little bit if we can call it a little bit about you um so yeah. the first thing i would uh, like to ask you since you have made your entry into bollywood recently what is right. it like to be an outsider in bollywood without having a godfather you know we hear about nepotism and everything how how was your journey what did you experience you know there's a, of course uh, there's a lot of nepotism in uh, bollywood but nepotism to be honest is everywhere i see it in a lot of um, businesses professions uh, it's 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 it exists in the entire world but in bollywood the problem is that we need of obviously we need a check on it because you have to have representation you have to have representation of talent and people who are talented but from film families you know you've got to coexist you've got to find a balance you cannot mm-hmm. just have people with names or you cannot just have people with an influence and of course some of them are so talented so i think it should always be about talent so whoever's the most talented should get a chance to shine doesn't matter where you come from you know it should always be about um, what you can bring to the table if you can bring a lot of uh, talent then it's great you should be on board that's what i think good and and you found it was pretty easy with your um really i wouldn't say it was easy that was yeah. easy but uh, because especially you know in uh, in the movies or if in india if you want to do a certain kind of work if you if you believe in doing a particular kind of work it's very very difficult because then there are more chances of more people with an influence trying to do that kind of work or with a surname trying to do th- uh, that kind of work so obviously it's very very difficult but um, yeah you've got to never say never because sometimes it just uh, works out good uh why don't you also tell us a little bit about your journey from a simple jammu boy to an international model to a bollywood um, star now so why don't you talk us a little bit about that you know to be honest i had i had i have um, if you talk about my journey i've done a few shows like if you talk about the ramp shows i have but not so many i was more of a commercial model i was more on the billboards so i was less of a fashion boy and more of a commercial happy boy you would see on a milk carton or you would see on a on a rickshaw or on a bus you know with a thing mm-hmm. like a you know like a brand in his hand but i did a lot of that so that was great so i think i was always more of a talkative commercial kind of uh, boy and hence acting but then i learned acting i went to barry john acting school i learned uh, acting uh, with barry barry sir and it was great and uh, i'm a trained actor that's why I I think acting is not like modeling it's very stupid to think that oh it's the same thing you know you just you just have to be okay looking and just smile a bit and it works out no it's 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 entire graph of a person that you bring on screen and you know it's like you have to be somebody else on screen and you have to live that life on screen and live it convincingly so that people should believe that uh, you are not sahil and you are here you sir for arjun or whoever i've played till now so so that's been my journey it's been very difficult and then to be into uh Uh, a world of hindi movies where like we've spoken it's a very different world with no um guidelines no rule book mm-hmm. no mm-hmm. exam so uh, unfortunately you know so it's it's all, like they say timing is very important it's all about timing it's all about who's where at what time and who's doing what uh, at what time what kind of project who knows who is also very important unfortunately mm-hmm. so you know it's it's a lot of uh, these things combined Good. Yeah. Um you know I've seen some uh, your Everest and then there is another one called Pow Pow and Powder and yeah. I was wondering those two were quite ahead um and you know very advanced kind of series. 
Right. Um, we don't. What is the reason you think we don't see these days much of um, that kind of uh, work being done? You know. Uh, see, I'll tell you, Indian television, I would say, is made for a certain kind of audience. It's made for, because, you know, in India, we have different countries in one country. So you have to cater to a lot of people. As an ek segment ko cater karoge, and then rest of them, you just ignore. Because like we know, unfortunately, we are still a developing country. So, you know, everybody has a different way of looking at entertainment. So I think 90% of the television in India, I won't say web, but television is made for the majority of the country, yeah. uh, which I, you know, earlier I would be like, "Kya ye masses classes?" But it's true. There is there is a thing called this is a masses product. This is a classes product. It's very very stupid. It's like putting people in a box. But that's exactly how people make products in India. Be it television shows, anything. The two shows that I did, Everest and uh, POW, Bandi Yutke, they were both filmmakers. They got on board. They wanted to make something uh, good for Indian TV and the audience, and that's how it happened. And I was lucky to do both of uh, the projects. But they were like movies on a on a small screen. I would say the quality and the content was very good. So I've been lucky i've been fortunate but that's been a conscious effort also i want to do that kind of work it just makes me feel better good um you know with corona most of the work is right now not happening things are shut down what are your views right. on you know uh, on corona and the world of uh, artists it's it's very very sad. I think uh, and I, I think yeah. Now everybody knows Mr. Bachchan has uh, Corona. He's Corona positive. Yeah. Varya Rai is Corona positive. Uh, Abish, uh, Amitabh's uh, Amitabh ji's son is Corona positive. Yeah. Abhishek Bachchan is Corona positive. Yes. So so you know like this. So like you say, Corona doesn't see where you come from. So it's very sad. We all have to be very careful. We have to take our precautions. And uh, yeah, that's my outlook on it. I'm taking a lot of precautions and I'm trying to be safe and keep my family safe. And I'm in Delhi with them. So it's, it's, it's good. Yeah. Great. And if um, you, now, if you answer part of the question, if you think, when will all the filming begin? I think in, a, in like four or five months, I would think. Like officially they'll get permission. Yeah. 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 And even, and definitely if it has to be off shoot, site shoot, if they have to travel yeah. outside, then it's going to be even more uh, difficult now. I know. I maybe, know, maybe in maybe in a way, it is good for India that the directors will now start relocating and thinking of shooting in Indian places, especially the hub which was in 60s, 70s, our Jammu and Kashmir, which was oh, yeah. every movie. Maybe they will yeah. think of going back there. You know. So, yes. Why not? I think that I would think be great. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> yeah. So since um, we all are from Jammu, some of our right. watching us are from Jammu. Some of our uh, who are watching us are. Global, so why not right. um, touch a little bit upon your memories of uh, Jammu and talk a little bit more about Jammu? So, yeah. um, hmm. okay. So the first question I'll ask you: What is Jammu for you? Jammu is uh, home for me. It's 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 my heartbeat. It's something that is um, inspirational for me for me because. That, that place is just magic, no? People are so nice, so simple, and so warm-hearted. I, I, I get so much love from people um, who are from Jammu. And I, even if they haven't seen my work, doesn't matter. They have to write wonderful things to me and be like, You know what I mean? So that honesty is there, yeah. that warmth. They're very, they're very good people. Like, so yeah. I would like to believe I'm also a representation of Jammu. And I'm a nice guy. <laughs> so that's Jammu for me. Nice people, beautiful place, um, honest, um, developed. It's, it's a big misconception uh, that people think Jammu is not so developed. I think Jammu is quite developed. Mm -hmm. You see, as per the Indian standards, it's, it's amazing. We have good uh, infrastructure there. It's a very, very clean city also, to be honest. Yes. Yes, you're right. And for the people who are not for ja from Jammu and Kashmir, just to let them know, Jammu, when we talk of Jammu, is just not a city. Jammu is a region. And a lot of areas come in it. It has almost 10 districts. So Jammu yes. in totality is very big and very beautiful. So it is still okay. untapped, untouched. People need to explore it more. Um, right. I agree. So Sahil, like all of us away from Jammu and not knowing when we can be back there as of now, you, are, you must be missing home too. What is the first thing you will do when you return to Jammu? I think I'm going to go mad, yeah. Lalit. I'll go running because Jammu has so much space. I mean, I'll go to jog ke liye and, less, and less pollution. I don't know the exact statistics, kya hai, but I think the pollution is definitely lesser. So I'll do the, I'll do the, the little things of life, you know, like I'll go for a, uh, for a, a jog. I'll, I'll go have the uh, chole kulche, which you get in pocket. 
<laughs> so, <laughs> so think, I do the 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 very basic, but you have to be grateful. Those things yeah. really get into. Yeah. Great. Just as you touched on it, I was coming on my next question, which talks about Dogras and their love for food. We are known. We are big foodies, and Dogra cuisine is a very royal cuisine with lots of variety. I am um, vegetarian, right. but I know there's a lot for non-vegetarians as well. They're like khatta meat and all. Uh, what is right. your favorite Dogra dish? You know, my favorite favorite Dogra dish would be. It's simple, but I love ambal. Ambal. I'm sure. Yeah, you know, you put it in dal, you sort it. You put it in chicken, you sort it. You put it over rice, you sort it. So ambal is my thing. Like, like you know, ambal is my mean, go-to dish. Hai. But ambal is <laughs> my favorite. Like I eat it every. I'm like full uh, Jammuite at heart. So I eat it wherever uh, I am at. Great. And for people like you, you you eat ambal on your own because you have to maintain certain look. But we we go ambal with our khamire, full drenched in oil, and we enjoy it that way. <laughs> We love yeah. for carbs. Yes, we love carbs. Carbs all the way, all the way. Hmm. So, yeah. um, since we are on food topic, what are right. your favorite food joints in Jammu? We have Jammu has lots of on the street food, baked joints, everything. You can say anyone. Which, which you can describe uh, both. So if, if if a lot of people would agree, but I I loved KC Plaza, yeah. There was this little joint, fast food joint, na KC Plaza. I grew up in Jammu, yeah. So oh, and yeah. Falak, restaurant, which is that KC. Falak is still there. famous, yeah. Yeah, yeah, yeah. So you know, when I used to go to Falak, Lalit, I would think that oh, I'm in uh, the fanciest restaurant in the world because you know it has that aura. You know, in Jammu, like Falak is the go-to place, and I, I it still is wonderful. So whenever I go to Jammu, I go to Falak. Okay. I remember you might not not sure, but when I was young and we used to visit. Um, Um, Jammu to all our family. There was a um, craze at that time. They had opened this jewels, and it was very oh. modern with all those ice cream machines and you know all those things. So I, in my yeah. childhood, we remembered we could not pass Jammu without you know entering there and enjoying all I, the fast food and things. that was kick. I know, and jewel was a cinema as well. Up to band ho gaya, yes. but theater yeah. be. Yeah. Yeah. Uh, I know. Be okay. Yeah. So. Okay, so since we talked about Jammu a little bit before, saying that Jammu is not only Jammu city; it's a region. There's so many right. beautiful places. It has untapped right. beauty, tourism. Uh, there's so much potential for tourism. People have still not explored it completely, and it right. above all, it's peaceful. Jammu region is peace. You don't yeah. get the same kind of um, problems you face in Srinagar. So in in that respect, which is your fam uh, favorite place in Jammu region to go for picnic or to for your peace or you just love that place for beauty or whatever? You, you know, picnic and all that. I used to go a lot to Patti Top. I used to go a lot to Kud. You know, Kud ka Patti sa with my mom, dad, and yeah. my dad Top. So uh, and then I used to go to Mansar and uh, Jajar Kotli. एंड मतलब मुझे बहुत सारी जगह वहाँ पता है क्योंकि मैं जम्मू ही पला बड़ा हूँ सो जजर कोटली इज़ अ ग्रेट प्लेस डेढ़ घंटा दूर है सिर्फ जम्मू सिटी से जहाँ मैं रहता था जहाँ बहुत सारे लोग जम्मू में वहीं रहते हैं मेन सिटी में सो या जजर कोटली मानसर पत्नी टॉप कुद ऑल दीज प्लेस डे एक्सकर्शन फॉर जम्मू आइज दे जस्ट पैक योर पिकनिक बैक फॉर द वीकेंड गो इन द मॉर्निंग कम बैक इन दिनिंग Good. Um, well, just at this moment, I will just remind whoever are with us. If there is any questions, please you can leave in the comment section. If you would like to ask anything to Sahil, we would love to ask your questions. Please feel free to. Um, to with mitte chole. So basically, ambal with mitte chole. I agree. Love to agree. That's good. Well, is everyone's favorite? Vikrant Gupta is saying hi, Vikrant. Hey, Bhavna. Hi, Bhavna. You're a simple soul, Sahil, which I am. Hi, 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 Sharma, Sanchita, hi, Jamwal, Rishab, Jadev, Jadeva, love from Jammu, love to Jammu. Hi, Coastal Babe, Dusky, Gulati, hi, how are you? I'm good. Parul, uh, let me see. Hi, Sahil, how are you? I'm good. Chumki, any questions related to Jammu though? Not hi, hi, Vijay Kumar, hi, Durge. We need more. Na, hi, oh, Mani, Jadev, Jammu, De Raja Ji. Wow, <laughs> love Raja Ji. Jadeva Ji, Jadeva. Oh, Tushar Tiyagi. Hi, Tushar. Tushar is a filmmaker. How are you? Hi, Janvi. How are you? Okay, so now tell me. Yes. And this Bhavna is saying she is your biggest fan. Bhavna is like, uh, is it Bhavna Jasra? Yes, yes, yes. Oh, she, 
she she she's my one of my closest closest friends from bombay she's like family and uh, she does that hand i don't know how, what do you call it man like she does the hand impressions uh, i i don't know what is it officially called but she does she's an artist in a way so she's uh, her family is like family to me um, love them so I we have them. a message from somebody who's your neighbor she's sana sharma we haven't met uh, sahil but i'm your neighbor in jammu you can ask gulzar uncle and sunita auntie about me i am rimpus and ram's daughter <laughs> hi sana sharma how are you sana sharma 01 uh, miss ho gaye sir fir se bolna 2g are ye oh my okay another thing i want to mention jammu still has 2g supposedly yes. hmm. which is a problem like uh, okay. and uh, kashmir uh, obviously but i didn't know that jammu region also has 2g now yes it's been almost it will be a first we did not have any internet then we have hmm. 2g and it's a big problem with the corona because if you see everybody now 24 by 7 is on internet the classes right. are on internet people have right. to work on internet so i think right. it is it is causing a lot of uh, problem and even when we are trying to do shows with artists from jammu or talks mm-hmm. with the you know dignitaries from jammu um mm-hmm. it is a big problem because it keeps on going broadband interrupted and you get the buffering so yeah it is a big issue Yeah, I see. I'm Madhav is also saying teach two G sucks buffering. <laughs> yeah. Okay. So I will ask you one question on this point: is that if you get to change one thing about Jammu, what would that be? One thing about Jammu, if I would like to change, um, To be honest, nothing. Oh, okay. Like if if I have to add something, I'll suppose that's the ad that I think we should have better connectivity. Not in terms of two G or four G. In terms of the flights, we don't have flights at night. Mm. I think we should have. You know, the airport only works in the day till about five PM. I think till the time the sunlight is there. So I think we should have flights at night. Yeah, we and should we, have like we that. And we all we also don't have flights from. Uh, we have flights from very limited places. So like you only have flights from Delhi and Bombay, something like that. Because last year. I remember we had to be in Udampur for my cousin's wedding, so right. I I reached from Delhi, but my wife had to come from Chandigarh, from Himachal right. to Chandigarh. To, there is no direct train to reach Udampur. There's no <laughs> flight to reach to Jammu from there. So it was a big right. detour to go by car to Ambala, then Ambala to a train to Jammu. So I, I think we need better. Yeah, that's right. We need better connectivity. <laughs> yeah, um, for sure. For sure. what we let's read some of the comments some people have been writing valhala is asking what are your views on bhadarwa you know yeah. hi valhala 10025 bahut hi mushkil naam dala aapne instagram ka uh, but uh, mai bhadarwa unfortunately gaya hi nahi hu quite a shame but i have never been to uh, bhadarwa yaar agar mai gaya hota so mai aapko bata pata but i'm sure bahut hi khoobsurat hoga so next time when i'm there i'll come there for sure but mai gaya nahi hu <laughs> So I Otherwise, grew up in. Oh. Sorry, sorry. Go on, go on. Yeah, so I grew up in Jammu, and I lived a lot in Srinagar as well. So, you know, yeah. Srinagar in the main city. So I remember Lal Chowk and the whole Dal Gate and Shankaracharya area. That's the areas I grew up in because my dad was posted there. So, well, I didn't know. I think there was even a posting who he was, but I didn't know. So I wouldn't really know. Just to let you know, Badarwa is one of the most beautiful places in Jammu region. It is the place where the film Nuri was shot. If you see the oh. film Nuri of Poonam Dilla and Farooq Sheikh, the whole movie is shot in Badarwa. Wow! Then it's time to get people back to Badarwa to shoot. Exactly. And <laughs> last last two weeks back, we do on International Dogra Society. Every Thursday, mm. we share. Jammu ki sir in that we share one region of Jammu area which people should visit for promoting tourism and we had right. uh, shared chenani chenani i don't know how to pronounce it correctly it's in right. um, udampur and that is the place where jani dushman movie was shot and i've shared oh. a, a song from that movie where rekha and all are dancing on top of um, houses and some huts and also one of the famous kila of chenani which was uh, oh, wow. built by the raja there Nikhil Anthal I, is a guy from there who gave me a lot of information on it. So our our so region will have also find producers in Jammu and Kashmir now, so that people can again shoot there. But exactly. Kashmir may be not right now, but Jammu region may be yes. Definitely, Kishtwar is there, Bhadarwa is there, Udampur is there. So many beautiful. Bani Basoli is amazingly beautiful. 
so i think it's time to get them there and with having people from our own land like you now in the industry yes. Uh, yes it would be easier to steer them i think we have uh, vikrant saying hi now as you are in india's best industry meeting a lot of people what have you come across as weirdest myth about jammu uh not about jammu i would say in general i have seen uh, a myth if you're talking about bollywood or entertainment in particular that small town people are not uh, groomed you know that they don't know how to you know so i lalit i studied in kendriya vidyalay like my social science was in hindi my science was in hindi sab kuch hindi mein tha bacche maa behan ki galiyon se kam mein baat hi nahi karte the even in fourth grade so if today i can speak uh, english uh, uh, i mean in an average way or if i my hindi is so good it's because i've taught myself so this is just a notion that you have to be from a big city uh, be even bombay or delhi to be groomed some small town people are super groomed and even if you're not groomed it's totally fine because raw talent is is amazing like there's nothing like raw talent everybody doesn't have to be like supremely groomed you know what i mean like sometimes when you raw you can be worked on even better because you can create characters even better because you've seen even more life you know what i mean you've seen the ups and the downs in the mm. and you you've stayed with all sorts of people so i think ye maine bahut bada myth dekha hai ki jammu ke log thode matlab groom nahi honge par aisa hai nahi jammu mein people are really really groomed very well behaved lots of very etiquette smart, yeah bahut, yeah bahut zyada tameez hai baat karne ki bahut tehzeeb hai bahut warm hai uh, and uh, थोड़े लाउड है डोगरा कल्चर हम थोड़े लाउड लोग हैं बट दिल के अच्छे हैं बहुत एटिकेट्स है दैट्स ट्रू एंड आई थिंक व्हाट ही मेंट वाज बिकॉज़ पीपल लाइक अस हु लिव आउटसाइड इन लंदन एंड स्टफ पीपल टेंड टू आस्क अस ओ वहां तो बड़ी बर्फ गिरती होगी टेररिज्म है आप लोग कैसे रहते होंगे और यू नो सम पीपल इवन थिंक दे थिंक वी गेट ऑफ द प्लेन वी टेक अ शिकारा टू गो टू आवर होम सो दैट्स नॉट यू नो बिकॉज़ यू नो आउटसाइड दे थिंक इट्स स्टेट ऑफ कश्मीर सो वी हैव टू टेल देम नो इट्स नॉट स्टेट ऑफ वेल नाउ इट्स नो लोंगर अ स्टेट बट व्हेन इट वाज अ स्टेट इट्स नॉट स्टेट ऑफ कश्मीर इट्स स्टेट ऑफ जम्मू एंड कश्मीर सो एजुकेशन इज वेरी इंपॉर्टेंट अबाउट आवर प्लेस फॉर पीपल आउटसाइड पीपल गुरु कश्मीर एंड दे दे कम टू मी एंड दे लाइक साहिल हम ना कश्मीर गए थे वहां इतनी बर्फ पड़ रही थी इतना मजा आया मैंने कहा ओके बट मैं कश्मीर से नहीं हूं मैं जम्मू से हूं दो इट्स द सेम थिंग इट्स वन स्टेट सो आई फॉर मी कश्मीर इज आल्सो आई लव कश्मीर एंड जम्मू इक्वली बट इट्स अ वेरी बिकॉज़ जम्मू एंड कश्मीर इज सच अ बिग स्टेट ना मतलब एरिया वाइज इतना बड़ा है कि अगर आप जम्मू से दिल्ली गाड़ी में जाओगे यू विल रीच फास्टर देन जम्मू टू श्रीनगर सो दैट्स द ऑफ लैंड वी हैव इन द ऑन द ऑन द इंडियन मैप so so that's another uh, you can say myth that people think jammu mein bhi barf padti hai jammu mein jammu mein hi shikar hai jammu mein nahi hai and then we have sim s she is asking when did you go to vishnu devi last time uh hi sim s uh i went i think mujhe date do saal ho gaya par main vishnu devi of course main bahut manta hu hamara pura parivar bahut manta hai and uh, vishnu devi uh, jo hamara matlab mannat mangte hain ya keh le aap ya har saal hum jate hain my mom believes a lot in vishnu devi so main jata rehta hu par abhi to is saal nahi gaya and pichle saal bhi nahi gaya i think date do saal ho gaya hoga mujhe right uh, vishnu since 1989 is asking right. have you ever faced nepotism hi vishnu uh yes i have faced nepotism and uh i it's uh, now if now see uh, if you would have asked me say 6 months back i would have said no 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 i haven't faced nepotism but now if i'll say i haven't faced nepotism i'll only sound like a biggest liar because now it's out in the open you know so i can't i can't so but i have no comment to make on it my only comment is that some people are very very talented no matter which background they come from you could be from any part of the world any part of the country any family any background any ethnicity any color uh that shouldn't be the guiding force uh, for your casting your guiding force should be if you are talented that's all nobody should even care about your surname nobody should care about your color skin color your weight that's also a major misconception that actors should be like fit as fuck because they, that is see if you want to be fit great because it makes you probably feel better men- mentally also mm-hmm. but acting is not about how fit you are yeah acting is about exactly. how well you emote with your eyes now if you if you emote well with your eyes and your voice and you can modulate it and you're a good actor so it doesn't matter if you weigh 100 kg or 50 kg if you're wheatish or white or doesn't matter nothing matters so that, so likewise you cannot 
people who look slightly okay or slightly i would say conventionally good looking you can't look down upon them also saying ki no no aapka wo actor wala wo feel nahi aa raha wo dard aana chahiye chehre pe you know what i'm trying to say dard wo screen pe aana chahiye maybe in person you don't see that dard you know that's the job of an actor you transform on screen that's your job so i think um, nepotism comes in different forms and everybody has been a victim everybody who's uh, probably watching it or has probably been a part of any job or business so yeah better representation we need in all the uh, spheres of life uh, rhythm jamwal is saying that she believes people don't even recognize the city by city she means jammu how would they recognize the talent it's only kashmir people forget it's jammu and kashmir exactly the uh, thing we were touching upon yeah uh, rhythm i come well how are you um uh see yeah i know but see sometimes you don't have to recognize the people recognize jammu nobody behaves like acha jammu kahan pe hai ye india mein hai ya us mein hai nobody says that people know what jammu is maybe they haven't been to jammu that's different so and sometimes too for the talent to be recognized it, like i said no um, pointers should be valid ki aap kahan se ho ya kya nothing matters all ma- all that matters is what you bring to the table and uske hisab se then jammu can get the recognition it deserves but i understand what she's saying uh, everybody thinks jammu and kashmir uh, mostly people know kashmir jammu thoda aise side line ho jata hai which is stupid but uh, i understand what she's saying though so i get you rhythm gulati 06 is uh, asking you sahil tell us your favorite childhood memory uh gulati ji my favorite childhood memory she's my very good friend by the way she she's a very very close friend we were we sh- we worked together on this show called pow which was made by nikhil adwani sir and um, so uh, parul my favorite childhood memory was uh, going to school in that stupid matador unhi hota jo chote chote matadors hi hote jo usme matlab bachcho ko aise bhed bakriyon ki tarah laad ke i was i used to be one of the bhed and bakri like this like you know uh, surrounded by 50 other kids and uh, so that's my favorite memory because jab aap school ja rahe hote jab aapke exam hote hain sabki kitabe khuli hoti hai sab padh rahe hote hain aur agar uh, if it's a fun day picnic type there also it's a lot of fun because chips ke packet nikal jate hain chocolates nikal jati hai so that uh, half an hour to get to school in that matador is my uh, is my favorite memory i would say and i would say that uh, people who are not from jammu would might not relate to the matador journey oh yeah yeah but, yeah, yeah. yeah. It's awesome, uh, you guys nahi malum yeah. uh, and and i feel a little bit after corona how would it matador people would really suffer now because even if everything becomes okay they won't be able to push people inside the way they used to if even if they could hang <laughs> people on the windows they would do that i know i know i know but you know sometimes i think uh, corona is going to change the world once it's done you know what i mean like even when the world will be declared corona free there'll be a new set of uh, rule book for everybody and uh, yeah so be it matadors or be it a corporate office everything's going to go a makeover go for a makeover cool i think uh, your friend gulati is on a roll she wants to ask you aapne kabhi school bunk kiya hai <laughs> she's uh, she's just being silly because i'm always silly with her मैं स्कूल हमेशा बंक किया है बट आई एम श्योर इनके जितना बंक नहीं किया होगा ये तो बहुत ही ज्यादा movie launch on hotstar what do you have to say about it why is the hard work of actors like him going unnoticed and ignored in bollywood your take on that hi 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 divan he ni hai bahut hi mushkil naam dal diya hai uh, with the jambal i think he's a great great gymnast he's a very he's a good action star like you know he's he's very good at doing all those cool stunts so it's very sad that he wasn't i even i don't know about this i'm so sorry yeah, i didn't know for the right person to comment on it is not my place but i don't know agar aisa hai to kyun nahi invite kiya i don't know kya maybe he's going to do some other event with them so iske bare mein sorry uh, i'm so stupid i don't even know about this so mujhe sorry but i love vidyut's whole action uh, game he's i haven't seen his acting work to be honest but i've i i keep seeing all the trailers that you know come for com- uh, commando and commando 2 and he was really good in all those action stunts that he does yeah that's for so sure. uh, I'm um hi Sahil bhai love from Jammu Amulya Hardo Love to Jammu 
a mulher love to jump. We have I have three uh, dogs here. Yes, I know you have and they're lovely. I love when you have your stories with them on Instagram and it shows your bond with your uh like with them very close. Um now you Sahil you've been very kind to give us all this time. Just the last call if there's any other question before I ask the last thing to Sahil. If anybody in the audience would like to ask anything or say anything, this is the time. Amulya is saying bro come to Jammu. <laughs> <laughs> just 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 no just come to jammu <laughs> abhi corona ho raha but come to jammu shubra yappa says sahil is the coolest guy on the gram oh shubra yappa is a very very close friend of mine she's a wonderful wonderful actor she she's right now she's working in the south but i'm sure she's going to do some kickass work in bollywood soon and uh, she's the coolest girl on the gram i love shubra again shubra is one of my closest friends like so yeah so thank she... you for joining us shubra we look forward to your bollywood debut yes um, So Sahil Salatia, we have another Sahil Salatia here. Sahil, who has my same name, and uh, actually there are two, three Sahil Salatias on my Instagram, ah, and they are very, wow. uh, very vocal about their uh, affection and their bond with me because I think we have the same name, na. So I think I connect to them also. Exactly. Because we have the same name. Dal diya, mare mata pita me. Hmm. <laughs> good, good, good. Um, Next, anything the, my, coming? Aul Raj thinks that I'm, uh, I'm my father was a movie star. Mm. We have spoken about nepotism much, yeah, Rahul. There's nothing to talk about. <laughs> That's now. It, uh, it's now. We everybody's been speaking about it. Anything in pipeline? Anything new? Upcoming movies? M- Unfortunately, Vikas. right now, right now, uh, Vikas. I'm sorry, but I'm not filming for anything because of the Corona thing. I was going to start uh, shooting for something, uh, but what be Corona? Because of course, it's a little bit pushed away. And now, because now, I think because of. Uh, Unfortunately, even Mr. Bachchan and his family getting it, I'm sure it's going to be taken more seriously and permissions will not be more difficult. So, now I don't have anything to tell you. But if you missing uh, me acting on screen, please watch Everest on Hotstar, and you can watch POW is not available, unfortunately, and you can watch Pani Path on Netflix, and you can watch Hasmuk. Hasmuk, I've done a special appearance, by the way, but it's a cool part. I did it for the filmmaker and Nikhil Gonzalez, very close friend. And uh, Nikhil Advani sir. So, it, but it's a very cool part of a movie star who's on drugs is a pagal admi. So you can watch Pani Path and Hasmuk on Netflix. Cool. Uh, Love Dogri is a very upcoming and a nice uh, page on uh, Gram, and he's doing very good work for Dogri. So obviously he's saying I, Dogri, bol do sir, bus. <laughs> Love Dogri sent a wonderful message today. I replied saying Jaydev and uh, to yeah. Love Dogri. What a beautiful page! They have like all the uh, some of the Dogri uh, pronunciation conversions, translations. Yes, yes, he's doing that as well. So on this this note, I'll ask you, Sahil, uh, yeah. before we end this conversation today, what right. would be that one message you would like to give all Jammu Walas? Ah, uh, one message I would like to give Jammu Walas is that uh, please uh, stay connected. not just to me to each other also and to me of course uh, the whole point of me doing this live today with the international dogra society was because i feel connected to the dogras i feel that it's ki hamari choti si community hai but uh, if we want we can bring a lot of change and you know we can support each other and uh, without any thing in return like whenever i see anything which is dogri i get very excited चाहे वो अम्बल हो या पत्नी टॉप का कोई वीडियो मैं देख लू या किसी की पोस्ट आई गेट वेरी एक्साइटेड बिकॉज आई फील अगर ये तो अपना होम ग्राउंड है यू नो सो वो घर वाली फीलिंग होना बहुत जरूरी है एंड सो आई थिंक वो फीलिंग आप हमेशा रखिए लाइक यू आर इन लंडन राइट नाउ बट यू स्टिल यू नो हेडिंग दिस पेज फॉर द डोग्रास टू कनेक्ट दैम एंड आई सी यू पूरा हैश टैग विच इज कनेक्टिंग डोग्रास सो आई नोट या सो आई नोट Little things and these things make all the difference, you know. Because you are you because everybody you should always make an effort to get your culture going. That it should always keep on going ahead. It shouldn't go missing. कि सौ साल बाद मतलब डोगरे गाये भी होंगे वैसा नहीं होना चाहिए मतलब आप you should move on with the world. Keep being urban and दुनिया के साथ मतलब time के साथ बदलो पर अपना culture भी intact रखो. So that's my message to all my Dogri buddies. That is exactly what we say, you know, Sahil. We all. Uh, we realize it more when we are out of our place you know that we all mm. are ambassadors of our culture our place where we come from our language so right. you know the way we talk we behave we um, show our culture people would know about it and far Under- too long we have been quiet dogra voice for some reason or the other has been quiet for very long either we were made quiet 
or the history was wrongly depicted but we were but now i i'm so happy to see so many pages like you know apna jammu love dogri and yeah. people doing fabulous work ambal ambal is another fabulous page ma dogri jammu now the all over right. whichever is coming to my mind and it's so right. good to see youngster doing it shouting right. from the top of their uh, house roofs if need be the world needs right. to know jammu Why? the world Why? needs to acknowledge dogras percent yeah like if you see punjabi bolo so sab ke paas ek dimag pe aata tha ye punjabi culture aisa hai kashmiri yeah. culture aisa uh uske baad uh, are ye south indian culture hi aisa hai kerala but in dogri i fully i, I agree with you ki thoda log confuse ho jate hain ye dogri kahan se hote hain you know main kya yeah. bol raha hu bahut zaruri hai ki hum isko foreground mein laaye and dogra culture ko foreground mein laaye because ultimately your culture is your um identity or one of the identities your your character sketch is based on the culture you come from so it's very important that we support the whole dogra uh, community and the dogra culture exactly so thank you so much for your time today sahil i really you appreciate much. this gesture whenever i for all the viewers whenever i have asked anything from sahil he has always been there to say yes and support whether it's a cause for which he needs to post uh, post a poster or anything he's always stood by us so we oh. also have to stand by him and together we are much more stronger a hundred percent a hundred percent it was so good talking to you lalit so so good same here thank you thank you everybody who joined us hopefully we'll be back with more of these sessions till then goodbye take care and jai madogri jai madogri bye bye bye